Hi everyone, my name is Shishale Kadarge. Today I am solving these 16 questions. So let's go start. So first question is write your code to the check null values. So basically I find the uh, which columns is null values. So I uh, co my code is select star from corona where recovery is null values. Recovery is my column name is null values is find the null values. My next question is if null values are present update them with zero for the all columns. So basically I am finding the uh, which columns is null values to provide to the automatically zero values. So uh, I am used to the annual functions. Annual function is used to the automatically uh, where it is null values to automatic to the provided zero value. Third question is checks total number of rows. So basically I use to the uh, count functions. This count function is the aggregate functions. Count means total the uh, columns rows is count. Uh, next question is checks what start date and end date. So basically I have used to the two aggregate functions. First is mean functions and max functions. Mean function is the minimum value in the database tables and max function is used to the maximum value in the database tables. So I have used to mean function as a start date and max function as a end date. Our next question is number of month present in the data set. So basically I have used to the uh, count function, distinct functions. So uh, distinct means the uh, uh, unique value shows. Basically unique value shows the that is the use for the this code selects count distinct month dates as a num months from the corona that's it so next question is finally monthly average for confirmed dates recovers so i find the average of confirmed average of dates average of recovers and finally monthly so basically i will use to the two cat dates is my columns and declare the month as a month and average confirmed as a average confirmed average dates as a average dates average recover as a average recover from table name and use to the group by that's it Next question is find the most frequent value for the confirmed dates recover each month. So basically uh, used to the frequent value is the largest uh, data in the table. So large, ma used to the max functions, uh, max confirmed, max date and max recovers each month to declare to the dates in month and used to the group by. That's it. So next question is the find the minimum values for the confirmed dates recover per year. So basically is similar to the uh, seventh questions, but is used to the minimum values to I uh, uh, used to the mean values and mean confirmed mean dates and mean recover. But is changes is a per year. So declare to the two care dates and why 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 as a year and used to the group by. That's it. So next question is find the maximum values of the confirmed dates recover per year. So basically I used to the group functions and uh, max functions, max, uh, max, max confirmed, max dates and max recover, but it changes is a per year. So to care dates year as a year, that's it. So next question is the total number of the each of the confirmed dates recovered each month year. So basically I used to the total number of cases to the sum functions and uh, uh, cases of confirmed to uh, each month year to two care dates month as a month and two care dates uh, as a year and some confirmed or some dates and some recover from corona and group by use to the group by that is next question checks how coronavirus spread out uh, with respect to the confirmed case for example total confirmed case their average variance and std so basically i use to the count confirmed as the total confirmed and average confirmed and variance confirmed and std confirmed from corona that is very simple this next question is checks how coronavirus spread out with the respect to the dead case per month for example total confirmation cases their average variance and etc so basically i have used to the selects to care dates and month as a month count confirmed average confirmed variance confirmed and std confirmed from the corona and used to the group by to care dates and mom that is output Next question is checks how coronavirus spread out with the respect to the recovery cases for example total confirmation cases their average variance and estimate. So similar to the AIT allocations bus is used to the count recover count confirmed and average recovered variance recovered and STD recovered and the from the corona table that's it. So next question is to find the country having the highest number of the confirmed cases. So basically I used to the select max uh, column name and the from the corona 
that is the maximum values in the uh, show in the database tables that's it so next question is to find the country having the lowest number of the dates cases so use to the select mean uh, functions so code is select mean uh, dates is my column name from the corona that's it uh, so next question is to find the top uh, top five countries having the highest recovery cases so basically i use to the uh, uh, dense rank over uh, and uh, order by so is this is the windows functions so select star form select country some recover as a total recover dense rank dense ranks means uh, um, ascending uh, required show over order by some over means uh, windows functions and some is recovered then uh, descending okay as a rank from the table then and use to the group by country and order by total recover descending where rank uh, less than equal to five so basically uh, output is the only top five countries shows that's it